Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna to take you inside my glam room and my beauty stash. So first I'm gonna take you inside my hair supply closet. This is where I come when I pack my kit and everything is clearly labeled and organized so it's easy to find things. I had a great organizer, Emma from Lifestyle Organizer, that helped me get this system going. Some of my must-haves in here are the Tresemme Micro Mist Hairspray. I love this, this super lightweight hairspray that won't weigh your hair down, and it also doesn't leave a residue like a lot of hairsprays. I also love the Color Wow Dream Coat. This is great before you blow dry. It's an anti-humidity spray, so if your hair is curly or wavy, it's really great to use. This is something that I love for just sleek, shiny blow dries and smooth looks. I also love the Bumble and Bumble Sumo Gel. This is one of those products that is great for slick, shiny looks, looks that need a lot of hold, especially great for high ponytails, sleek braids, controlling baby hairs, and laying down the hairline. And then I have all these great bins here that organize my hot tools. So I've got my hair dryers from here from GHD. I love the Air and the Helios dryer my diffuser, flat irons are in this bin, and then I have a separate set of tools for when I travel. I also have all of my brushes on these Lazy Susan, so it's easy to find and grab. I love the wet brush at the moment. I've got really great wet brush brown brushes, the detangling brushes, the combs, basically anything you could ever need. Welcome to my hair closet. This is where I sort and organize all of my hair extensions and wigs. When you are a hairstylist, you have to be prepared for every job and no matter what the model's hair looks like, you have to have extensions that match because who knows what curveball is gonna get thrown at you that day of the shoot. So I have everything color coordinated here and then they're clipped on little hair extension hangers. You can also use baby hangers or pant hangers if they're really small. But Hidden Crown Hair, if you order their extensions, it comes with a great hanger, so it's really easy to keep everything organized. So obviously I have a lot of hair extensions, but for a new hairstylist, I don't want you to get discouraged or think you have to go out and buy a ton of extensions. Extensions are a big investment, and when you're first starting out, they're really expensive, and sometimes the price you're getting paid for a job is equal to or less than the cost of the extensions that you need to bring. So make sure you take really good care of your extensions so that you can use them over a long period of time and that they're worth that money for you. So this is my vanity area where I get ready in the morning. It's also where I shoot hair tutorials. So I just got this amazing Ricky light for my vanity. I actually got it because it was recommended by Katie Jane Hughes, who is an amazing makeup artist and posts the best tutorials on her Insta story. The lighting in her videos is always so good, so I had to get the light that she had. It's also an amazing light because it has this magnifying mirror that has magnets on the back that make it really easy to stick on here so that you can get a closer look when you're doing a tutorial. And then it has this great phone stand that also easily sticks on here with magnets so that if you're shooting a tutorial, um, you can easily shoot yourself with great light. So I'm gonna take you inside of my drawers here where I sit and get ready in the morning. The top drawer is all of my makeup. So everything is clearly organized because Lifestyle Organizer came in here and helped me out too. I'll show you a few items I'm obsessed with with makeup right now. I've got the Tatcha Skin Canvas. This is a primer you put on before you do your makeup. It kind of blurs your foundation and evens out your pore size. It's been really great under your makeup and really makes it last longer throughout the day. I also am so excited about the Makeup by Mario Sephora Brush Kit. Not only does it come in this really chic bag, but it basically has all the brushes you could possibly need. And for someone that doesn't really know that much about brushes for makeup, everything's really clearly labeled. So it's easy to find the brush that you need for each specific item. I also wanna show you this eyeshadow palette that I have from Persona Cosmetic. She makes the best colors for all of these palettes. These are really vibrant and beautiful. She has a lot of different palettes in different shades and ranges. This is the Identity 2 palette. I also love the Identity palette. My current favorite mascara is the Marc Jacobs mascara. Just makes your lashes look so thick and full and long, almost like you're wearing false lashes. I would highly recommend this. 
I've also been using the Lawless Foundation. This is a clean and vegan beauty brand, so it makes me feel good that I'm putting something that is free of harsh chemicals on my face. And it also has great coverage, really similar to like high-end foundation. Inside this next drawer, I have all of my lip products. Um, I'll show you a few of my current faves. I have tons of lip colors. I'm that girl that has 50 shades of nude lip colors. I keep buying the same colors, but when you like something, you like something. First, I have the Mindful Five. This is a new lip balm from Smashbox. It's a great lip primer before you do your regular lip routine. I also like it before bed because it's super hydrating and it looks pink, but it just goes on really clear. So this is great in the winter months when your lips are really dry. I also have been loving the Bite Lip Crayons. These are amazing. They go on so silky and smooth. Um, I also love that the tip is pointed, so it's really easy to do your lip liner. And then I just fill it in. They have so many different colors. Like I honestly have so many of these. Um, they're all really great, and I think that they look great on all different skin tones. Like we barely scratched the surface of my glam room so i'll have to do another video will you guys please comment and let me know what i can expand on and what other videos you want to see from me and make sure to like and subscribe to my channel bye guys thanks for watching